Hello developers, welcome to Octocoder. In our previous tutorial, you learned how to download the MongoDB Community Edition MSI file and initiate the installation process as demonstrated. However, while some developers successfully completed the installations, others encounter issues. For some, the installation process froze midway, failing to reach completion. Additionally, even for those whose installation seemingly succeeded, MongoDB Compass either failed to install properly or encountered functionality issues. With MongoDB Compass connections receiving the dreaded connect icon refuse error leading to failed database connection. In this video, we are diving deep into troubleshooting these common scenarios. I'll guide you through both the installation process and resolving issues that may arise along the way. So, if you have been grappling with MongoDB installation challenges, this tutorial is tailored just for you. Let's get started. All right, let's dive into MongoDB Compass installation. If you haven't already, make sure you have downloaded the MongoDB Compass MSI file. Not sure how? Check out our previous tutorials where I walk you through the process step by step. Once you have the MongoDB MSI file, double click or hit enter to begin the setup. The setup window will appear. Simply click next, accept the license agreement, select complete there's usually nothing to change and proceed with the installation some of you might encounter freezing during installation if this happens give it a few minutes if it still doesn't progress cancel the setup and try again then start again the setup do the same process next next until the mongodb compass install this option do not check if you have checked this option, then please uncheck and do the installation process. Okay, so now MongoDB services are installed on your Windows, but MongoDB Compass is not installed on your system. And you want MongoDB Compass, right? So for that, we have to download separately MongoDB Compass. So go to MongoDB official website, click on the product tab and select Compass from the drop down menu under tools section. Here, scroll down and you will see tools like MongoDB Shell download. If you want, you can download it. Okay. Scroll down and you will see MongoDB Compass download GUI. This is what we needed. So you can select version 1.42.5 is current stable version in April 2024. This will change in future. Okay. Then Select platform according to your system, ok, exe nothing to change and click on download button and the download will start. It is 131 MB software size, ok, it will take few minutes to download according to your internet speed, ok. Once downloaded, initiate the installation process. After successful installation, MongoDB Compass will open. If it doesn't open automatically, you can search for MongoDB Compass here. You'll see MongoDB Compass and launch it manually. Now, on to the tricky part. Connecting MongoDB Compass. Many encounter the connect icon refuse error. Don't panic. Open your task manager, navigate to the services tab and scroll down until you find MongoDB. Notice that it stopped. This explains why MongoDB Compass isn't connecting. If it stops, all you have to do is right click and start the process. Wait a few seconds to start process and now as you can see the MongoDB is running. So let's return to MongoDB Compass and now click on connect. And voila, now your MongoDB Compass is successfully connected and you can seamlessly access your database. If you are interested in learning how to insert data into MongoDB Compass and on Atlas, check out our Find My Restaurant series. It's a full stack RESTful API project where you learn everything from scratch. It's definitely worth your time. You can find the link in the description or click here. That's it for today's tutorial. Whether your database connection is successful or not, let us know in the comment box. If you found this helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to Octocoder channel for more coding tutorials. Thank you for watching.